I'm Brooklyn Bagwell, casting director for Doomsday Preppers. Big crowds came out for the Survivalist and Prepper Expo in Prescott Valley, Arizona to check out items like medical supplies and water filters. And the products on display here cover all of their prepping needs. So I'm here with Greg Lito with Biffy Bag, and he is going to show me about his pocket-sized disposable toilet. Everything you need for a nice, comfortable relief experience comes in this little package. <laughs> Only weighs 65 grams. That's about half as much as a cell phone. Small enough to fit in the glove box, tackle box, toolbox, backpack, go bag, purse. Comes with eight feet of toilet paper, a nice big 10 by 11 wet wipe to freshen up with when you're done. Aww. And then the super absorbent Biffy powder. It'll solidify all the liquid, turns it into a gel. Helps with the leak protection and also the odor control. You need to have liquid to activate it. And you'll see it <gasps> activate right away. Ew, I would freak out. Yeah, so you can see it releasing the odor neutralizer gas right away. See that? <laughs> the gas is going right away. And then in about all oh, 30 seconds or so, you'll start to see it stratify right here. And so oh. that's sealed in all the odor now with a solid mass. And then it'll keep solidifying all the way down until it's solid just like what you see here. You do you have this in your bug out bag? Yes, I do. You do? How many? I put five of them in there. Biffy Bag's odor control abilities have already made them perfect for cavers and mountain climbers traveling in close quarters. But durability is also important, especially in a doomsday scenario. It's got a 50 PSI burst strength on it, so the bag isn't going to break. Uh, it's been dropped from 25 feet in the air and still holds its own. I kind of want to try this thing on. OK. So you open it. Like, am I doing it right? Yep, you're doing it just fine. Leave it attached. It matches my dress. Yes, that's beautiful. OK, I'm sold. You just take that's the right. uh, straps and tie it around your waist. <laughs> Once you have it tied up. Oh, my god. There's the money shot. There we go. No one will ever know. Yeah, and then okay. bend your legs slightly and uh, let gravity take care of the rest. When you're done, I always recommend tying in a knot. And then that'll uh, keep the three layers of leak protection in place. Stuff it back in the bag. I like your little saying. I like this. Okay. The no bucket, no odor, no mess. All right. No bucket, no, bucket, no odor, odor, no, no mess. mess. The Arizona Survivalist and Prepper Expo had everything an aspiring or experienced prepper could want. But this state isn't the only prepper hotspot. And next time, I'm headed to the Self-Reliance Expo in the mountains of Colorado.